Space Cadet report for the Lavernian Magistrate. Space Cadet 87R, Lawrence Spurlock. People used to ask Space Cadet 87R why he got into the satellite and protection racket. His answer was simple. The excitement, mate, plus the hours are good. Out there on the surface of a Klaxian moon with the barbie, a brolly, some sausies and some prawns, that's obviously when Lance just like to kick back and relax. Yeah, but really, mate, what a tosser. Talk about being out of sync with the universe. He's a bloody galah. Oh, I mean, this joke is a real space cadet. Oh, I don't mean a space cadet, space cadet, mate. Oh, I mean a space cadet, duh. Not space cadet saving the universe from tyranny, if you're with me. Yeah, that's right, mate. You keep trying. Have another beer while you're at it. No, the shadow is going to move to the same exact spot. Oh, that'd really freeze your saveloy, wouldn't it? Well, just in terms of a procedural thing. Shouldn't the Space Cadet have been tested for performance enfeebling drugs? Might have been an idea. You can fool around with the soundtrack, mate. But there she is. The shadow will move again to the same exact spot. No prizes for guessing uh, what's going to happen next, then. Oh, well, Bill Furloff would be ashamed if he was still alive. Makes me glad he's not. Uh, <laughs> Oh, have a go, ya mug. Even in these days of Liburnium, Klaxi and Dayton, you don't try and have a Barbie anywhere near a low-flying Klaxi and Moon Squid's floating pod, do you? Certainly not. Talk about a trap for young players. <laughs>